To download Photoshop for free, we'll be using a website called Pixlr, which is a free online photo editor. Once you're on Pixlr, which I'll link to in the description box below, scroll down and then click on Pixlr Editor, which is their advanced photo editor and includes the exact same features as Photoshop. Once we click on that, you can either click to open an image, create a new image, or access the AI image generator. Let's click on Create New, and from here, you're able to select the design size of your choice. Under Recommended, you can select a social media post, social media story, web med, thumbnail, wide thumbnail, art grid, 12MPX, or 8MPX. You can also click on these options up top to access design sizes for photos, social media posts, web posts, print posts, or videos. For instance, let's select social and then Instagram post. Over here on the right, you can then change the name of your file, change the width of your design, select the background color of your choice if you wish to have one, or untoggle this option to have the background be transparent, and then click on Create. This will take you to the Pixlr editor, which is exactly like Photoshop. Over here on the left, you're able to access all the exact same features as any Photoshop editor. You're able to click on Arrange to move, transform, and change layer settings, on the Marquee Select to create selections with the Square and Circle Selection tool, the Lasso Select to use the freehand Polygon Bezier or Magnetic Lasso to create a selection, the Wand Select to use the Magic Wand to select areas with similar colors, the Crop Tool to trim, cut, and straighten the canvas by free or fixed aspect, the cutout or mask tool to mask areas and or remove backgrounds, cut out objects or crop trim individual layers, the liquify option to grow, shrink, and push parts of the image, use liquify to make subtle adjustments to portraits and other images, the heal tool to remove spots and wanted objects, blemishes, and clean up images, the clone tool to draw and copy from other areas in an image, the Blur, Sharpen, or Smudge tool to draw over areas in the image to sharpen, blur, or smudge details, the Focus or Bokeh tool to create depth in your photos with background blur, bokeh blur, and bokeh lights, the Disperse tool to draw over an area in your image and watch it explode and disperse into thousands of pieces, the Dodge or Burn tool to lighten or darken areas of the image to bring out dark areas or dim light ones, the sponge or color tool to brush vibrance, saturation, or temperature in local areas to pop or reduce colors, the pen tool to use different types of creative pens like web, crayons, ink, and tail to doodle and draw, the draw tool to draw and doodle with different brushes and colors, the eraser tool to erase parts of an image with a brush, use cutout tool for finer result, the Color Replace option to change one color in an area to another by drawing over, the Fill tool to fill whole areas with a single color, the Gradient tool to create blends with the different colors and transparencies, the Frame or Image Holder tool to define an area to place an image and cut it to a variety of shapes, the placed image is auto-scaled and cropped to fit. Frames are an essential part of creating reusable templates, the Shape tool to draw different pixel or vector shapes like squares, circles, lines, and more. The Text tool to add new text layer or use one of our text templates. The Picker tool to pick colors from the image to use with other tools. The Zoom tool to zoom in or out of the photo to focus on different parts. As well as the Hand or Pen tool to move the viewable area when the image is zoomed in. Hold spacebar in any tool. You can also access here at the bottom the color picker as well as the option to switch colors. Just like with Photoshop, you're able to access the Navigate, Layer section, as well as the History sections. In this free Photoshop version, you're also able to access the options up top, including File, New Image, Open Image, Open Image URL, Stock Search, Browse Elements, Save, Export, Print, or Close. Edit, Undo, Redo, Cut, Copy, Clear, Paste, Free Transform, Free Distort, Transform, Stroke, Fill, AI Generate Fill, and Preferences. Image, Image Size, Canvas Size, Smart Resize, AI Super Scale, AI Generative Expand, Canvas Background, Canvas Rotation, Crop, and Trim. 
layer, new layer, duplicate layer, add image as layer, add element layer, add URL as layer, delete layer, rasterize layer, merge down, merge visible, flatten image, bring forward or up, send backward or down, AI auto mask, add mask, apply mask, remove mask, or more mask, select, including select all, select pixel, select subject, deselect, invert selection, convert to mask, save selection, and restore selection, Adjustment, including auto-adjust, auto-pop, auto-black and white, brightness and contrast, temperature and tint, hue and saturation, vibrance, mimic HDR, color balance, color lookup, monochrome, highlights and shadows, exposure, curves, levels, threshold, threshold alpha, posterize, desaturate, invert, and solarize, filter, including effects library, AI super sharp, AI remove noise, details, glitches, creative, vignette, bloom, glamour, dehaze, inner glow, outer glow, outline, drop shadow, bevel, find edges, pixelate, mosaic, or half tone, view, including toggle floating panels, restore all panels, quick link bar, navigator panel, layers panel, history panel, zoom in, zoom out, Fit screen, fill screen, 100%, 200%, 300%, toggle preview mode, toggle full screen, and change theme or colors, as well as help, including keyboard shortcuts, get help, our YouTube tutorials, our Instagram, our Facebook, and report issues. Up here on top, you can also click to toggle home, unlock, and duplicate. And there you have it. With Plixler Editor, you're able to download and use Photoshop for free. If you liked this video, make sure to download the free cheat sheet with the absolute best tools you need for your online business, which I link to in the description box below.